Okay, across the board, men are clueless about how Most pleasure. Men are oh, clueless. Of course, of course. Yeah. But so many of them have no idea about the landscape of a vulva. They have no idea where to touch, what to do. They could be like. I thought we were talking in such general terms for a minute. <laughs> And then you jump right in, so to speak. Uh, well, we have to get, you know, I have a, a mission here for the women of the world because I still want men to really understand the landscape of how to pleasure a woman. Sometimes they can be four or five inches away from any spot that would be even remotely bring a woman pleasure. Am I not correct? <laughs> All the men just left the studio <laughs> and are having a beer at TGIFs. Uh, now, so, so, okay, so what assignments do you give men to help them understand that area of the woman's body? Well, for example, I would have a guy uh, go home with his wife, and uh, what he would do is, uh, he would, his job would be to describe sort of how beautiful and gorgeous her vulva is. Just sort of look at it <laughs> and, and worship it. With, so what, what, you know, like, like... Does he put on... He like puts on a mining hat and uh, I mean, what, what, are we, what, what are we talking about specifically? He's down there and he's got the light on and yeah. See, women women don't really need to be touched to be aroused. Like just being adored, looking at the coloration, okay, the beauty. I, you use and you use uh, visual aids. I'm told as well. You I use do. Uh, props. I do because so I, I want my guys to be cliterate. <laughs> it's harmless. It's like a little pillow. <laughs> A puppet. It, it's very, very friendly. It's actually a puppet. <laughs> yeah. It's a lovely. You look like Yogi Bear at the. <laughs> Come on, burn one in here right now. Come on. Give me some pepper right in here. Come on, come on. So, so where, where would you touch? No, I'm not gonna. gonna no. It's user it's friendly. It's very harmless. <laughs> and it's educative. I can teach men all about the different parts and, of course, the most. All right, all right. Well, do we, are we, I don't even know. This is all going to be hexed out by NBC, probably. <laughs> no, they're fine with this? They're Too fine. bad. <laughs> well, anyway, so, uh, yeah, I know. Uh, so, so uh, you just uh, carry this thing around wherever you go. How does it work? When what? kids are bored at a party, you whip this out? <laughs> Well, you see, I, I don't use, know. <laughs> I use it. That's what I mean. See, no, where would you start, really? Where just point to the area that's the most significant? No, I'm not going to. I don't have. I believe. Just, just give me your finger. I'll put it on there. <laughs> I think maybe not over there. Maybe okay. over there. Careful. <laughs> I've heard that before. Uh, I'm, all right, I'm that's nice. <laughs> yeah, look, and what a nice accessory to the yes, chair. Yes, it is nice. <laughs> it substitutes, mm -hmm. as, yeah. you know. Oh, stop this, it. Actually, this puppet is responsible for thousands and thousands of women experiencing pleasure. Uh, explain that taught. one. What are you talking I, I, about? I, <laughs> that puppet alone? That, yeah, because I, I use it to teach men the different parts of yes, female I anatomy. Understand. And then they become clitorate, and then their wives are happy, which is the whole point.